some offensive players sig basically signifying we need to know where number 10 is at all times. And now they go to the pistol in the throwing situation. Against Eastern Michigan in his last bowl game, Drew Hare threw four touchdowns, zero picks. Here comes pressure. Over the middle, high throw to Galladay, makes the grab, and the first down. Ball comes loose at the end. Toledo ball. What? Northern Illinois, they caught Toledo in man-to-man -man coverage. They run the crossing route right over the middle. It was a, fumble it was a great by catch team. by Kenny Galladay, but it looked like it was either Cheatham Norrells or Dewan Rogers it was that popped that ball up for a huge play, giving the ball back to Toledo. It was indeed Rogers. Let's see. Ball clearly out before the knee was down. So Toledo takes over now. First and 10 now for the Husky. Second possession. Here comes pressure right up the middle. Force the thigh throw. Oh, this, we're going to hit him in the mouth. And then we're going to hit him again. It's our best against their best. Pocket collapses on Hare. He's going to run for it. Two guys for a long time. They're very familiar with their counterparts, Aiden Conlon and Andrew Ness. Here comes pressure. Deep ball. Knocked away. I'm sorry. sorry. You're going to have to go old school and wait until you get on the, get in the car on the way to the airport. I was watching Notre Dame Temple on my iPhone trick or treat last really. week. <laughs> now Lewis on the smoke route. Gets knocked out of bounds. All right. Another jet sweep to Tommy Lee Lewis, and he's losing yards, going back. Trips to the right, one receiver to the left. Hare over the middle. Complete first down. Galladay loses it. Incomplete. Plot trying to get in a better matchup, but what a great breakup by Dewan Rogers. Rogers missed the last two games with an ankle injury, and boy, are they sure glad to have him back. Want to be a wide receiver and go over the middle, kid? <laughs> Ness making his 51st career start. It's a loss of 32. Now they get it to Breskison for the short game. And there's the break the Huskies needed. Johnson falls on it. Not taken. Now here, pressure up the middle, gets away. Scrambling to the left. And escapes out of bounds after picking up. So what they're looking at right now is the left left knee of Tommy Lee Lewis. It was his right ankle this year, his left foot last year. Now it's the left knee they're looking at. Second and five. Hare looking for the deep ball to Galladay. That looks like it's going to be an interception by Mathis. It's offense, Kenny Galladay. They're going to go to him, and they come out of the break trying to take a shot. But the sophomore, Trayvon Mathis, who has about a four-inch height disadvantage, just plays the ball perfectly, and he gets good body position, then turns back and finds the football, tracks it in the air. Dead time. I got plenty at the pontificate about, too. You're right. Second and 23. And they're bringing pressure off the edge. Picked up, and Graham, with some poise, finds Galladay. This has already had two big plays. But this is the Huskies' quarter. When Drew Hare's normally at the controls, now it's Ryan Graham, the redshirt freshman. And a big hit there on Huff. Yeah, they've seemingly owned the third quarter. Looks like this game is possibly going to come down to the fourth quarter, as these games so often have the last five years. Graham on the screen low. They had that set up. Galladay, good throw, and he could have... But on third and long, at your own 22, how much do you trust... The redshirt freshman. Five on the play clock. Here comes pressure. Gets it to Galladay. Great tackle in space by Dewan Rajay. The most here tonight. They like him on these crossing routes. And I think especially with Graham in, it's just a higher percentage throw than trying to chuck it down the side. We change the plan here for the Huskies with 350 and counting. Left, slant to Turner. Makes the grab, still on his feet. Including yards have been slant routes, drag routes over the middle. Now here looking to throw another slant. He hooks up with Galladay. 
So a first down into Toledo territory. The guy where they just run him down the sideline on a nine route. But that's a tough throw for a quarterback, especially for a redshirt freshman. So what do you do where it's just a much easier pitch and catch there for the quarterback? Now Huff gets outside, gets the first down. So the Huskies are moving. If they let Graham throw it on third and six. Pressure up the middle, hits it to Galladay. First down, Northern Illinois, as he delivers a blow at the end of that to the freshman Tichi. What was this? A fresh set of downs for NIU. And they start with two backs. Graham's going to keep it himself. Spins closer to the downs on the season. Third most in FBS, behind only Leonard Fournette and Greg Ward Jr., the quarterback at Houston. Plenty of time on the play clock. Now Graham looking to throw. Looking for Galladay. Touchdown, Northern Illinois. He beat Norrells and made the one-handed grab. Touchdown, Northern Illinois. One-handed grab, but does he get a foot in bounds? Graham just puts it up for the tall receiver. Now you got to see possession. That right foot's down. Right foot's down. I did not see from that angle the ball popping around. Uh, you don't see the foot there. Yeah, he kind of double catches, but was the foot in bounds at that time? Again, Rick Jackson upstairs looking at these replays. Catch. And there's a foot, and then yeah. it's hard to see there. But again, the ball, from the other angle, the ball did pop out, and he catches it a second time. Well, we're going for two. So they've decided. They got the thumbs up. Graham pitches it to Buonio. Wow. Norrells burned for the touchdown, comes up for the tackle. Out after having a huge first half. They swing it out to Turner. Swift comes up, but he gets away from the tackle. Trent Voss running him down. Four on the play clock. Graham forced out of the pocket. Finds Galladay right at the marker. Norell Graham by rolling him outside, getting him a clear view, and here's the replay. Boy, that left arm certainly shoved Norell to the ground. Now from the 41, Graham steps up. Down the seam, Galladay makes the catch! Swift brings him. And how much confidence do they have in Ryan Graham here on this play? A 44-yard shot right there.